All right, good afternoon. We are actually <clears throat> in the afternoon now. Um, uh, well, let's get let's get started. So, I want to I, I want to keep it relevant, kind of continue on uh, a bit of a similar uh, thing with with Chicago and things like that. I wanted to talk about three organizations in particular. They are part of Folk Nation now. As far as I understand, there's supposed to be a lot of organizations under Folk Nation. Um, but I'm just talking about three. I'm talking about, uh, I'm just going to get into, I don't really, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't pre-prepare or, or plan these out. So there's three disciples I'm going to talk about. The Gangster Disciples, Saint Disciples, and Maniac Land Disciples. And, um... What I'm going to talk about is is a bit of their name and symbology, because I, I touched on that and and, and I, but I only touched on the GDs and I and, and I didn't really get into that. It was more uh, focused towards um, uh, the, the the other ones, uh, the other uh, organizations. So and now I did talk about the GDs. I basically said they are like they take. A, being a gangster or, or that kind of world into like almost like somebody studying kung fu at, 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 a, at, a, at a temple somewhere in the Shaolin monk temple um so so we, we did kind of deal with that and and, and, I, and I might get into them a little more uh, after but I wanted to start with the same disciples um, um <laughs> so I want to start with the same. Okay, so with the same disciples, when you talk about symbology in the name, first of all, okay, they're all disciples. We've, we've already talked about the disciple part, but you know, you got Satan, right? Satan's disciples, right? So th the big deal is Satan. Now we talked about something like like the Playboys who use the bunny, and we talked about that. The Latin Kings, how everyone's a king. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, well, well, I guess that's what they're trying to say, that, like, you know, lions are kings, um, regardless, and lionesses are, are queens, so they, they take on, like, like, they're all kings and queens, basically. That's what they take on. The Land Kings is a bit of a, a broader organization, so they, they, they are, it's easier to recruit, you know what I mean? It's just people just recruiting all over. They love mobbing, they love getting just shitloads of people. You can be a king, you can be a queen, you can be a king, you can... That's kind of their mentality. Um, they're very spread out, uh, and their numbers are, are their numbers are quite high. Um, yeah, so so their, num <laughs> their numbers are quite high. Oh, something's bothering me here. Yeah, the, the, their numbers are quite high, by the way. And uh, so so that's the, uh, the Latin Kings. Now... Um, um, and I've talked about uh, gangs that, 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 that are named stuff like Latin snakes or different kind of stuff. And, and I talked about snakes already. I really got in depth on, on the snakes, by the way. I don't really need to do that anymore. Um, but I wanted to kind of get these, these disciples stuff going. So for the same disciples, they're using Satan as a symbology. Um, however, rarely do they use like the typical devil horn Satan kind of thing. Uh, which makes them a bit different from satanic organizations and satanic cults. This is a bit of a gang uh, or, or, or free enterprise organization, but and and the gang part is important. You know, even if you're told you can be a Satan disciple and be totally legit, but there's still a gang element to the to, to the organization, and I think that's important to have a gang element to the organization uh, to kind of make them understand that they came from a, you know both sides and b b both worlds. And that they are willing to get a little bit immature at times on a satanic level. <laughs> Not on a satanic level. Okay, so they typically use a, a baby Satan, right? To the point that sometimes he might even wear a diaper or, 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 or he's just in underwear and, and he's a little baby Satan. You know what I mean? Now, how do you gauge what Satan Disciple is about? Um, if it's not satanic, it, they're not giving off a satanic, like, like satanic church kind of image. So how do you really gauge them? And I'll be honest, I, I, I'm, I'm, I, I'll try right now. Uh, as far as I know, uh, the fact that the Satan is a baby uh, shows that there is some kind of high level of immaturity going on. 
okay? Um, and that's something, and that's why I talked about the gang element is because there are some things that just don't go away. You know, even if you go legit, there's some things that don't go away. Your mentality, your attitude, uh, every now and then, you know, you're a little Satan baby or, or, or you're listening to a Satan baby, you know, um, uh, you, you know, you know what I mean? But we can't gauge what he's about. All we know is that he's mischievous. That he, I mean, naturally he's evil, but but the whole thing is not about evil. It's just kind of a mischievous immaturity. Um, you know what I mean? Um, resort to to those emotions that takes you to that place, and uh, you know, embro em embroider yourself in those actions. And 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 there is the same baby. And, and until now, I cannot give a full explanation on it. I I. I you know what I mean? And that's that's one of the, the, the oddities with the Satan disciples. You know what I mean? Um, you know, and I'm not going to... But, but there are gangs where you just don't understand. Or organizations, just, you know what I mean? What are you going to say? Because none of us have ever seen Satan. A lot of people doubt that Satan never existed. Uh, we know nothing about him. So we have almost a mythical creature uh, who's supposed to be heading or, or the sy symbolical, you know, heads of the gang. Which I think is 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 is, is 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 what it is. What I said. Now moving to the MLDs, the Maniac Land Disciples. So they put Latin in their name. Okay. So the Gangster Disciples did not put any race in their name or or, or culture or anything. Neither did the Satan Disciples. Okay. Um, now the Maniac Land Disciples put Latin in there. Um, so let's dissect it. Right? So we have, I've explained the whole disciple thing. It's almost taking it to a study. So what do they take into a study? So they put, they put the maniac in there and they put the lion in there, right? Now they didn't call it, uh, they could have called it the local Spanish disciples, uh, the local, the Latin local disciples or something like that, right? But that probably didn't, didn't fly with them. The fact that they chose the word maniac to me uh, over local, choosing the word maniac is kind of like uh, uh, a bit of an Americanization. I mean, to tell me I'm wrong, this is just my dissection and my opinion. To me, maniac is 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 a bit of an Americanization, uh, and that's why they didn't call it local LLDs. They called it MLDs. It's a bit of an Amer um, American it, 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 Americanization while still putting Latin in there. So, so what are we looking at? Like second, third generation, fourth generation? You know what I mean? We're talking about kids who grew up in the States, uh, uh, although they may speak a little bit of Spanish or speak Spanish at home, um, and they are Latin and they're proud of their Latin descent, but it, you know, they're not exactly salsa dancing and eating empanadas all day long, <laughs> you know what I mean? Or, or eating tacos and burritos all day long. No, nah, nah, I, I, that's, that's, that, that's unfair. Tacos and burritos are extremely popular, okay? So, you, you know what I mean? That's what I see from them. Is that they're a bunch of, and typically when you see them, they're in big numbers, uh, not uh, kind of unlike the Latin kings. You know, the MLDs uh, are are kind of like, like like the Latin kings just take numbers upon numbers. You know, oh, you want to join? You want to join? Hey, why don't you and all your ten buddies join? You know what I mean? That's kind of what, and, and the Latin kings is like it's almost like a community. You know, they'll even go to church together. You know what I mean? All these guys and girls are going to church together. You know what I mean? And, and then it makes me think like, what kind of what kind of gang is this? You know, this is this is, this is quite a, it's kind of odd. You know, to me, the Latin Kings. I just, I just, I've never understood the Latin Kings. To be honest, I have never understood them. Yeah, you, know, you know what I mean. Can't understand them. But but back to the MLDs. The MLDs like to show that they're strong, and 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 that's a big thing. They they they, they like to show that they are strong individually, but that they don't. They're not into individualism. Okay, they're strong individually, but they like to be in groups. They like to be in groups where everybody's about equally as strong, pretty much. So all these guys get together and it's all about, you know, they call it, I wouldn't call it squad, I would call it grouping because it's a bit larger than a squad. They like to get into groups where everybody's strong and and everybody's, and I when I say strong, I, I, I mean on every level, physically, mentally, uh, on every level. They like to be strong and they like to be in groups and you know they got a certain culture to them now i'm almost at 10 minutes which means i should probably wrap this video up i, I feel like i've said enough about uh, i can't say any more on on both of them on the, on the sds and the mlds let's go back to gangster disciples and we'll end it there 
Now, uh, one, one thing that we do know about the Gangster Disciples is they also offer a uh, legit path out. Right. So not that you're out of the organization, but that you continue on in the organization, but you go legit. They actually offer that option. What they do is in prison and jails, uh, they, they, they do a group called growth and development. Right. Uh, instead of gangster disciples called it's still GD, but it's growth and development. <clears throat> so it's all about exercising, reading, uh, 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 learning. And um, and that can be as a, as a gangster because look you committed a crime to come into jail or prison so what are or you've been convicted regardless right so what are you gonna do when you um what do you call it when you're there what are you gonna do now are you gonna continue you just want criminal life that's all you want or do you want a way out do you want growth and development while you're still part of the organization but a way out of the criminal life so until legit life so that's what growth and development is about apparently. Now the GDs are, are are quite disciplined. I'll tell you right now. The G, well, I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know anything about them for in, in, in specifically. But I know that as an organization, the way they portray themselves is that they are they, they're a bit more disciplined. It's kind of how they portray themselves that they have a bit of a, a discipline and they they're not on that. Um, I don't know whatever you want to call it. They kind they, they're about discipline. I'm gonna wrap this up with the same disciples. Um, I just, uh, you know, it's a, they just, I don't know. I don't know. I, I think that's the best way to end this. I just, I, I don't know. I don't know how to put it. I like, nobody knows. Like, like, what, like, where did the idea of baby Satan even come from? The baby Satan and, 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 and he's, he's scary. I mean, I, 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 that's the best way to end it. You know, I, that's what I see. And I'll be honest with you. That's what I see. I see this baby Satan. He's either in yellow or red. Okay, his skin is supposed to be yellow. And I look at this baby Satan and I think to myself, I go, that is one hell of a scary MF. That's what I think. When I look, I go, that, like, I just see this baby Satan and I go, I do not want to mess with this one. I don't, and I'm serious. Like, I look at that, I go, I don't want to mess with that. Something about it just shows me a, a, a evil, uh, not able to control his emotions. MF, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Just an evil will just blast out, will go, just lose his emotions. Uh, if you upset him, if you say something the wrong way, if you're not, if you're doing anything that will upset him, he will go off on you and you do not want that. All right, I'm gonna wrap it up with that. I think that's good enough. I, you know, I know I'm a little late today with the video, but 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 here it goes and, uh, and, and we'll call it uh, good afternoon.